and the results are in. What you're seeing on the left is taken at ISO 6400. What you're seeing on the right is taken at ISO 640. Shutter speed the same for both, 1 60th and aperture 5.6 on both. Let's see if we can drag this one on the right back to some kind of existence. So let's develop and increase the exposure here and then go back for a little side by side view of them both. Let's see if we can have a little peep around and see what can be seen. So the one on the left is ISO 6400, the one on the right is ISO 640 that's been pushed in Lightroom. And the conclusion is I can see no difference. You could go ahead and clean both of these up with noise reduction, but I'm just trying to give you some base examples here at the moment. Okay, let's move on. That is showing them to be the same. Let's see what others we have here. Let's compare these two. Okay, on the left, ISO 500. On the right, ISO 100. Okay, let's go in and see what kind of exposure has been pushed on to the ISO 100 photo. Up to by 2.3, let's reset it. Okay, so there it stands as it was. Bring them up side by side to have a little look around. Let's flip them back. So on the left, ISO 500. On the right, ISO 100. Shutter speed on both, 1 400 for F4. Push this one, one stop, two stops, and have a little peek about. Let's have a look at all the, the detail here. Full size samples www.spdtdl.com slash tutorials. Okay. Well, I won't waste your time staring at this screen for hours because I've been doing that most of the day and I couldn't tell any difference. Anyway. Let's carry on. What else do we have? Let's have a look at these two. On the left, what do we have? So on the left, ISO 500, 1 to 50 for F4. And on the right, ISO 100, 1 to 50 if F4. Let's have a peek about. Okay, 
details. Yeah. I can see no difference. Let's carry on though. What do we have on this one? Okay, so on the left, ISO 6400 and on the right, ISO 640, 1 40th of a second at F8 and 1 40th of a second at F8. Let's have a look. Okay. Hmm. I think you've guessed it by now. I can see no difference. Well, these have all been kind of wide-angled shots. Let's have a look, see if we can see any fine details with these last two, just to really put this to bed. Okay, let's see what we've got here. On the left, ISO 6400, and on the right, ISO 640. Shutter speed 140th at f8 and shutter speed 140th at f8. Let's dive in. Okay. Wow, well, I mean, I'm trying to spot something. Really and truly. Oh, what do you think here? So difficult. It's certainly not enough for me to kind of be able to call it out 100%. We can even try pushing this ISO 641 a little bit. another third of a stop added and really I can't just can't call it And there you have it. If you really want to dive into these deeply, www.spdtdl.com slash tutorials, search for the name of this video. But as good as makes no difference, I really cannot see anything that absolutely stands out as a difference here. So make of that what you will leave me a comment if you think we should have done the test differently or if you've got any other thoughts and insights because this is a very emotional topic so let's have a discussion and as usual it's been emotional